So that just happened. Shiwan does not trust his teacher no longer. He went into Black Origin Threshold or White Origin Threshold, and he is now attacking his teacher. He slightly has sanity, as we can see in this chapter, and he goes after the Nine Arch Dragon. He's like, I don't trust you, Nine Arch Dragon. He doesn't even call his teacher by like his name. Or even teacher, he just says Nine Arch Dragon. So you see how he lost all form of respect for the Nine Arch Dragon in this chapter. Th this chapter, being literal with all of you, there's not much I can personally dive into and talk about because 90% of this chapter was flashbacks, but the flashbacks were executed properly we needed this seeing the flashbacks and seeing how she was contemplating in his mind of what he's been through for the journey of the breaker and what he's experienced because of his teacher and how he deeply cared for his teacher is just it, it's it's sad to see how much the nanorous dragon has slightly changed how much he used to hold the nanorous dragon on this pedestal and in this chapter he says i no longer trust you and he attacks his own teacher to see how these flashbacks were executed, we needed that to see, you know, the development that Shiwan is currently going through, what he is currently thinking, the pain and emotions he's feeling, because he looked at his teacher through a majority of this series, like 90% of the series so far, even more than that, he has looked at the Nine Arch Dragon as a very good and kind person. He's always looked at his teacher as if he was a kind-hearted guy, he's not evil, he's not bad, he wouldn't harm a fly unless, you know, it was to be a just cause and to see how he finally realized how his teacher was when he looks at the corpse of elder kwan that one panel alone when you see the black panel just nothing but black you see shiwan glowing and you see elder kwan just sitting there dead with a hole in his chest that panel alone even though it didn't have as great artwork as normal chapters do there was the meaning behind the blackness of the panel it's like the emptiness of what Shiwan currently feels at that moment. I feel like that's what that panel is trying to emphasize. The em uh, emptiness that he currently feels in his heart after he lost someone that took care of him. Uh, helped him out in his time of need. And to see that, it's sad. It really is sad. Like, this chapter is just straight up 99% hype. It really is. And I, I can't wait to see the next chapter. This is one thing I have to say. These chapters may be short, there may be slight sometimes where there's barely anything to talk about, but you cannot deny that these chapters are fucking amazing when they come around. Like, when we have chapters like this, they're, they're just absolutely freaking amazing. Like, the quality when it comes to the artwork, the fighting, and then with the dialogue alone, it's just, you feel your heart pumping when you are reading these chapters and just to see how this chapter was done the pacing the way it was you know fleshed out with how she was thinking about the past I, I don't feel like this could be any better than it already was so it seems like next week we're going to have quite the battle because she wants not backing down he, he's not taking no more shit from the nine arch dragon he's done he doesn't trust him and we do know part two is coming to an end, like I've been saying, and it's already obvious there's going to be a part three. And so, since this is coming around, I believe the way this is going, you know, the Nine Arch Dragon might die. Like, he straight up might die, because he still has the detonation button that can blow up the entire area. And on top of that, you know, Kaiser's sitting there watching, and so something shady might go along the lines there. So there's a lot of things going on in the background, we don't know exactly what direction this fight's going to take, but... We, we'll have to see. We'll, we'll just straight up have to see. That's pretty much this chapter of The Breaker. I, I, I'm hype. I'm just 99% hype right now. I may not look it, but I am really freaking hype to see the next chapter. Like, The Breaker is quickly becoming one of my favorite series I read weekly. Like, it's just, it's so great. Like, this is why I'm so happy I started this series. Because even though it has some very short chapters, it feels like I'm only reading like 30 seconds. They're just so damn good. Just so freaking good good so tell me your thoughts you all have a wonderful day or night wherever you live please be safe chibi out